five Will Rock's national award-winning Studio East, where rock bands get intimate and strip it down acoustically. You can stream live video of Will Rock Studio East performances at 95willrock.com. Powered by the U.S. Army. They're strong, and then there's Army Strong. Learn more about the U.S. Army at GoArmy.com. Now, let's go live to 95 Will Rock Studio East. Entering their 10th year is a band, fifth album due out June 3rd and playing tonight at home in Arlington Heights. We welcome to Studio East for the first time. Hell yeah. What's up? I was hoping after that little improvisational jazz session that maybe that was going to be, you were going to have like a theme song for me as I was introducing you. That's what we're doing. We're writing you a theme song. Yeah. I need that. This is good. This is good. Put a little... No, you know what? I was going to say we can add my name into that somehow and then we can turn it into like a Scott Bop Bop deal kind of thing. Oh, yeah. Yeah, like we're, 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 getting, we're getting in on this. Tom doesn't have a mic, so he can't scat. <laughs> but see, Chad, like you got it. You got the scat. Yeah. I can figure it out. It'll sound terrible. But see, that's it. That's all we need. I'm stealing that. That's going to be my new intro music to my show every single afternoon. Sweet. So just so you know, that's what you got yourself into. You but hell it. yeah, awesome that you're here playing tonight at home in Arlington Heights with New Year's Day, Escape the Fate, and From Ashes to New. And I have to say, saw you for the first time this weekend at Rock on the Range. I know it's been forever since you've been to Chicago and Milwaukee. So while it's not Chicago or Milwaukee and it's Ohio, I'm glad that I caught you. Yeah. But playing tonight at home in Arlington Heights. And I was telling a couple of the guys here, you know, I've listened to all the records. I know that some of the records have some heavy stuff on it, but seeing you live, I was like, these guys are heavy. Yeah, so that's yeah. what I've been saying all this week. Like, if you hear alcohol and ass and you think that that's what you're getting, that's not, that's, what, you're that's not what you're getting. That's not what you're getting. That's not what you're getting. And so then, of course, knowing that you guys were coming in acoustic after seeing that this weekend, I'm like, well, this is going to be a treat. Yeah, so acoustic is, is not something that you guys typically do, I'm guessing, right? We don't really do it, but we have kind of have some... We've kind of prepared for it. Yeah. Well, I'm glad that you guys decided to make a stop in to see us to do this this afternoon. Thanks for having us. Of course. Of course. It's our pleasure. Now, that's got to be kind of cool playing, you know, a big 30,000 sold out arena coming to a place like home tonight that's like, I don't know, 1,000 people coming sure. in here where there's 30 and then Rocklahoma again this week. Like, that's crazy to do it all in one week, right? Yeah. It's, it's a lot of stuff. I mean, I guess because what you guys are doing, you're putting on the same show, whether you're playing in front of 50,000 or... 10 at that that's point, always right? been that's been always been our mentality I mean it's like when you're a young band and you're starting and you're playing in front of five people you just think you made it you know sure and then you know but if you always just have that passion to where it doesn't matter how many people you're playing in front of it's still it's it's your music is from your heart and it's it's real and it's got to be real you know what I mean so it's it feels good Good. To play in front of any any amount of people. It's a privilege, uh, privilege to play in front of you guys today. Thank you guys so much for coming. Absolutely. <laughs> well, let's play in front of these people, shall we? This is a song called Hush. Until you break your neck Hell's where I was born Hell's where I was raised This hell is where I'm from And this hell is where I'll stay The hush is all I need To hush some misery The hush that belongs to me Like the hush inside of me Just be still and pray And let the noise just fade away Between the violence Like a secret closet So don't walk up in a train You just can't stand the 
touch Affection weighs too much You push everyone away From the reckoning Of the venom stings Whips so bad I piss myself So with the beatings from that belt If this reminds you of home You better know you're not alone Hold the gun up to my I'll pull the trigger on myself Hell's where I was born Hell's where I was raised This hell is where I'm from And this hell is where I'll stay The hush is all I need To hush the misery The hush that belongs to me Like the hush that's Just be still The Rock Station, hell yeah, live in Studio East. Now, that album on the Blood for Blood album, and now you have the new album, Undeniable, coming out June 3rd. We've been playing Human off that record, which I love, and I can't wait to hear more of it. Have yep. you been adding any more new songs into the live set yet? Human's in. Good. Human's in right now. Good. But we're just kind of like... You know what I mean? You yeah. Gotta, you got to go slow with it. Well, and especially I mean? because once that record comes out, you're going to be playing all that new stuff. And so right. I'm, I'm sure you're excited to get get to some new stuff because you've been playing oh, this other stuff now you, for, no you know, for so long. Yeah, <laughs> but that's true. And before the record comes out, I mean, you know, just going to shows as a, as a fan of the music, if a band starts playing songs that you have no idea what they are, right. You're kind of standing there, and you're like, "Well, maybe I can get into this." And like, yeah. but then once you have the record, that maybe turns into like, yeah. "That's what they want to hear." Exactly. So I can. We've I done can that get in the that. past, where we toured for probably about three or four months before the record came out. You know, and it was like nobody really knew what. That was, was going like on, the beer know? break. <laughs> you, want, you, want, you want everybody to be able to enjoy it. Yeah, you know yeah. I mean? But so. we can. We'll be hearing human tonight. We will be, yeah, you will be hearing human. Good, if good. If you're there, if you can Excellent. make the trip. Excellent. Yeah, Home in Arlington Heights is the show tonight with Hell Yeah, New Year's Day, Escape the Fate, and From Ashes to New. And uh, let's talk about this album because, Tom, I saw in, uh, in a, another interview that you did that there's some stuff on this record that you are adding some stuff in that you've never tried before. So what are we expecting? Sorry, I know you don't have a mic. I can come uh, sit on your lap. Now know. that we're friends, I mean, you wrote my, you wrote my theme song. We're friends now. I, I mean, it's just... You know, it's just another digging deep journey for us to do stuff that we haven't done before, like adding just elements. I'm going to come behind you so these people can hear you out there in Radio Land. Just elements of, of just music and Chad just digging deeper. And it's a, it's a really heavy story. You know, he's, you know, all of us, we've, we've I think for the, from our last record with songs like Hush and Moss, I think our fans can expect and won't be surprised when we do slower, somber stuff, you know. And it's still heavy. I mean, his lyrics just make it, you know... It'll it'll get you. It's it'll get you. And uh, a special guest on this record that comes in the form of Dimebag Daryl. Talk about yeah. that. Yeah. It's, this is crazy. This is exciting. It's pretty incredible. I mean, uh, 
So tell us there, there, there was a, there was a whole story that went down. Brady brought it up in the in the in the studio uh, that we should cover that song. And this you is know, I don't care anymore for I those who don't, care don't know. Anymore yeah, by Phil Collins, and it, which I was absolutely down for completely. And then you know, Vinny's like. Me and my brother recorded this song like 14 years ago. No we way. Had, yeah, we're no like, idea. what? So it was yeah. just your idea to do the song. Yeah. And then yeah. he was just like, wait, I think we have audio of this. Yeah. 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 Out of the blue. No and, clue. And dime audio. So uh, it was actually recorded on a radar system, which it was like Pro Tools and Radar. It's like, which one is going to excel you know mm -hmm. pro tools excelled and radar just kind of fell off the radar and uh <laughs> yeah. so we had to get these so we had to like outsource uh this piece of equipment to be able to actually extract the 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 performance off of it mm -hmm. you know to to even be able to use it and then we've contacted the company and they had one laying around somewhere and we got, were able to get the tape and so stuff. the fact that so you were we, able to, we, even able to do this it, it's, was, it was incredible yeah. it was about a th it was about a two month process yeah sure from 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 the incarnation the beginning of it to the actually getting the tracks took about two months of solid solid work wow but it was absolutely worth it. I mean, he's like our sixth member. Yeah. So to have him be able to come back and resurrect it and just playing on our record, it's just, it's, it's, it's right, unbelievable. Right, right. I mean, I'm not even a guitar player, and he was my one of my biggest heroes in music, so. I, I tell you uh, what, man, it was like uh, getting to sit in the studio and, and record guitar tracks to dimes playing with, with, like, goosebumps the entire time. It was, it was unreal. Like, he's a, he's a hero of mine, too. And, I mean, we were going to do the song whether or not we were able to use those, but the fact that we were able to use those was just such a, an amazing thing. You know? Sure. I mean, and, not, it, and, you know, and not only for you guys, but for Vinny to be, you know, to, to have that too on, on another project of his. You know, exactly. that, that's really yeah. awesome too. Exactly. Yeah, definitely. It's, it's a, absolutely, absolutely amazing. To and that, be able to and that play, track is to going be able, to be on Undeniable. Yes. Awesome. And I'm singing on a, I'm singing on a song yeah, with my hero. Yeah, you know? so yeah. it's So many levels of just badassery. Yeah. Can I say that? Yeah, Probably badassery should. for sure. <laughs> I like that word. That's a good word. Well, I'm excited for you guys, and I'm excited to Thank hear you. it as a fan, of course, of Dimes, and as a fan of, of all of yours, too. It, it, that's going to be very special. It's a great track, and it's a very me track. I don't care anymore. I'm kind of that kind of dude. <laughs> you know what I mean? So everybody was like... I can, I can kind of tell. Yeah. I can kind of see that. Everybody's like, oh man, I want to hear Chad singing this song. <laughs> so. And now I'm trying to picture you singing that. So yeah, I, I need. Oh, to it's different. I, I bet. I bet. <laughs> it's not Phil Collins. <laughs> it's not. It's not Phil. But I'm going to tell you what. I'm telling you what. For me, it's one thing to know a song. I've known that song for 30 years. Sure. But to. Uh, it's just like you see frogs hopping around, but when you actually dissect one in science class, mm -hmm. it's a whole different level, right? Sure. So I heard the okay. song, and then I had to dissect the song. And I'm telling you what, the vocal performance on that song that Phil did is incredible. I mean, it is incredible. And it was a really, really hard song to just get the basics of and learn it. More or I less worked really, your really own hard. thing, too. Well, you can tell he's a drummer. I mean, you can tell he's a fantastic drummer because the way that he syncopates and the way that he his uh, fluctuations move with the rhythm, it's it's pretty incredible. And has he heard this yet? Have you shared it with him yet? We don't know. Like, yo, Phil. Kevin, Kevin Archerko, <laughs> our producer, has actually worked with Phil Collins before. and he That said might he was be a way to get it in. Yeah, well, he said he was going to send it to him, but we just haven't heard yet. Oh, okay. The next time I'm you're sure going to have to come like back it. and you're going to have to report back. I'm sure he'll like on it. The, it's, uh, it's on the, the Phil Collins review of Hell Yeah's version. Yeah. <laughs> I well, don't just care keep, your, keep your eyes open, people. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so cool. Looking forward we're to not ho We're old. hoping for We don't get these. So right. that's, that's it. We want these. That's it. <laughs> Two thumbs up. Right. Undeniable comes out June 3rd. Hell Yeah playing tonight at home in Arlington Heights. And what are you guys going to do for us? Something new? Oh. Something older? We're going to do Okay. Love it. Let's do it live with Hell Yeah. Moth. Well, then let's do them off. Like 
skin and I'm all since the day I was born Wounds and I'm like a crown upon a king So happy they alive and the pain that they pay Life is gonna blow me but for what I'll never know Drawn into the fire is your reap what I saw
studio lease. The new album, Undeniable, comes out June 3rd. Be on the lookout for that. And playing tonight at home in Arlington Heights with New Year's Day, Escape the Fates, and From Ashes to New. Thank you guys. Truly awesome having you guys in to play for us this afternoon. Thank you so much to you. To Thank you to tonight. the station. Thanks to everybody that showed up here today, man. This is really what it's all about. This is it's all about caring and sharing our bond as music. Make sure you make it to the shows. Support heavy metal. Support metal. And you are in for a metal show tonight. And from Ashes to New, we'll be live with them next in 95 Will Rock Studio East.